Hello everyone, it is Mike Levin on March 14th, 2022, here on a Circa 2020 Macintosh, uh, Intel-based processor, uh, running OBS, recording my desktop, and uh, you'll probably hardly recognize it as Mac the way I run it. Nothing should be in the taskbar except what's running, so you can use it as a task switcher. That's in my philosophy. And then the things you actually want to launch, you can keep here. And when things open full screen, they cover the launch icon. So this video is about Microsoft Edge. So here we have Microsoft Edge on uh, the Mac, which in itself is uh, something somewhat interesting. I'll go full screen. And then I will uh, perform a search on almost anything. Let's say, uh, what is domain authority? And we'll see if we get uh, the new Bing uh, typing answer. And as you can see, we don't. Oftentimes, it, it appears over here. Uh, but I've been having uh, the mixed results on uh, Windows as well. We do have the chat link there. so. Here you have it, the new Bing on a Macintosh, on Microsoft Edge on a Macintosh. And, uh, you know, you could go on, like, you know, uh, is DA still used today? And you can see little things like um, one of 15, right? So the number of questions Microsoft is giving you for the new Bing is much higher than it used to be. Just like last week, it was only five questions in order to deal with Bing getting weird and the hallucination issues. And here we are like barely a week later and uh, you can go up to 15 questions. So uh, yeah. What else to point out here? I think I'd like to point out how Bing is dealing with these citations and references. It's it's much better than you maybe even think. So it's like, oh, are they giving out links? Well, here you can see, yes, they are actually giving out the links. There they are, all ready and um, you know, sh ready to click. But if you copy. And I'll go to another desktop. And then I'll bring up an app. Well, I don't know. Is it called Text Editor on the Mac? Text Edit. All right, Text Edit. Is that the built in one? Text Edit Location. There, yeah, that's the program, Text Edit. And I will paste it in. And look at how useful of information that is there. Let's see if I can make it bigger. I guess I could just make it bigger with fonts, right? 24 point font. Look at how nicely they're breaking things out uh, with these, I guess, footnote type things. So there's one, and here's where one starts. They don't do the line break exactly right for prettiness, but the line break would really be there. And if we make uh, this go full screen, it'd probably be prettier because the line wraps are better. So, you know, here's the answer. Reference one, reference four. There's apparently twos or threes or somewhere in here, but anyway, here are the references and the links. So as you can see, the new form of SEO that's kind of being, you know, uh, ushered in now by chat bots happens to be very friendly towards giving out the traffic and the citation and link to the cited sources uh, in search, which is right here. Isn't that nice? And I'm demonstrating it to you on a Mac desktop. So there you have it, the new Bing in Microsoft Edge on a Mac and a little bit of insight that most people don't have these days. I'll do one more. I'm uh, probably running out. The interface is interesting, seeing that scroll up and scroll down to go between normal, old-fashioned type results and the more chat-like results. There's some innovative UI things going on here. So I'll just say, you know, list the top 
SEO, you know, um, let's call it SERP tracker companies. We'll do that and we'll see uh, advertisements come up because this demonstration would hardly be complete without showing you how Microsoft is experimenting uh, with blending in the ads. And this should probably <laughs> trigger some of them off. No, and it has not. Very interesting. Top SERP, top SEO companies. That should trigger off some ads. Now they're experimenting, so you know, you can hardly really um, hold them to whatever behavior they, they just used to behave uh, or just used to have. Interesting. <laughs> yeah, well, it's not inserting the ad links. SEO products. Funny seeing companies I either work for or have worked for in the search results that go by. So, you know, I'll wrap up here. Uh, suffice to say that uh, when they do slip ads in, they're slipped in in exactly the same way these little uh, number references and uh, and links are slip, slipped in. So as you can see, you can actually click here and, and visit the site itself, right? Right from these interactive chat sessions. So it's really a nice, uh, nice environment, nice alternative to traditional uh, search results that uh, Microsoft is giving us here with Bing, the new Bing. And uh, it works uh, just as well on the Mac. Thanks for joining me. Hope to see you again soon. Don't forget to subscribe.